Okay, I'm making this quick little clip to say I'm going to my vocal lesson in a couple minutes. And I'm gonna work on the songs, well, song that I wanna do for Theatre Ontario and also a possible second option for Theatre Ontario. And that's about it. This week's vlog is gonna be a little bit different because honestly, I don't have too much career-wise going on. I will be working 30 hours this week at work. <laughs> So I don't really exactly have too, too much spare time, but I'll talk to you about the spare time that I have and what I'm using it for. The little bit of spare time that I have is going to be used to, one, do my ballet classes, which I did one yesterday. And on Thursday, I will be doing one again. Another thing that I'm probably going to be doing is possibly seeing a dance show. One of my ballet teachers is actually in a show, so I'm most likely gonna go see that as long as I get my stuff together and um, buy my ticket and whatnot I'll take this opportunity to kind of mention the whole viewing performance arts when you can will really help in the success you will have as a performing artist sometimes the best way to learn is to watch and I know for me I'm definitely one of those people who is very observant and I learn a lot from watching things or watching people make mistakes so I know how to do things right either way in, in a performing show or even like a movie or a TV show you can learn by literally just watching it as long as you have the headspace that you are watching it knowing you're learning from it you will learn from it although I'm not doing anything that is going to help me get a job right now watching theater or watching film is teaching me something is teaching me something that I couldn't necessarily learn from a workshop or doing it on my own. Mom, night, you're such a problem. Here, can you just go up here? Mona. Anyways, this is a very short vlog because really that's all I have to say. Um, I haven't been submitting for as much stuff lately because I'm kind of in that point in time where I don't want to submit for a whole bunch of things until I know I'm sort of already going to see what my demo reel is going to look like at this point in time. I'm more than alright with doing unpaid film stuff right now, but now that I've done three in a short period of time and it's kind of been crazy with me bugging my manager and this is part of the reason too is the fact that I don't want to inconvenience my manager I don't want to end up being stuck there because I have applied for other jobs and didn't hear back from anything and be stuck there and then kind of be treated like a new person even though I've been there for over three years because that's kind of been my full job at this point in time that's where all my money is coming from I kind of want to make the best of it even though I do go through phases where I literally want to leave so bad like even a few weeks ago I was in that headspace I wanted to leave even without having a backup job at that certain point in time because I was just so sick of being there really like it's not like I'm enjoying the job anymore but there are times phases where it will be extremely like emotionally stressful because I'm at this job that I had planned to leave after graduating and I'm still there now <laughs> three months after graduating. At this point in time, I don't see any time that I'm going to leave it, uh, which is kind of a hard thing because I'm not making any money off of what I want to do at the moment. That's also kind of a stressful thing, even though I'm not actually frustrated by that right now because I saw this coming. I'm not delusional and I don't think that I will be successful right now. I believe within time, as long as I keep my stamina going, with applying, submitting for stuff, and keeping myself busy in this portion of the industry that I will eventually get something that will pay me and it will be a good thing. Honestly, I think that's it for this vlog. I don't really have much footage and I'm sorry. I hope I will have the guts to kind of film more things outside of my own home, but we will see. And I hope you enjoyed this and bye-bye. <laughs>